All right, guys. This book today I have is, I don't even know how to describe it, but I'm going to read the back of it so you kind of understand where, where I'm coming from. It's called A Bucket of Awesome. And it says, "The life, Your Life's More Amazing Than You Realize Guidebook by Katherine Thompson, creator of Drops of Awesome. So when you look at the back, it says, your life has a story and every day you choose how to tell that story. Is it tragic, hilarious, boring, triumphant? You decide. And every day you choose the tone <clears throat> of what happens. You choose the tone of what happens next based on the way you remember and frame your past. Bucket of Awesome is a processing and writing guidebook to help put your life into joyful and hopeful focus. Working through its pages, you will learn and remember all the things that have made your life remarkable, and, and you will come to tell your story from a place of joy and optimism. Hmm. So, so yeah, it's um, it's one of those like rubbery feeling little books. Um, it's the perfect size to throw in your purse. Um, when I got this book, I just immediately jumped in. Um, thank you for the publisher for sending this to me to, to check it out. And they have an introduction here. Um, it's a very good read. I suggest you guys read this part. I read it all last night. Um, I'm just going to kind of skip these pages because it was so fun. Y'all, I seriously jumped right in. This page basically asks you, you know, about yourself, about your family, the, um, where you went to school, your siblings, your favorites, this, that, and the other. And then in between the prompts, you have pages where you could write about your past, write about the subject, um, just anything. You can write about anything you want. Get that on the pages. Get it out your brain. And then I think I did the next one too. Um, I started working on some of these prompts and some of these, you know, favorite movies, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Okay, I stopped right there. Um, and then you just have all of these amazing um, prompts and things that makes it so easy for you. Um, I, I can just see, you know, one day my daughter finding this book and I wrote a lot of stuff about her and myself and, you know, her dad and just, it really lets people know who you are and your past and your present and your goals. And it's, it's so exciting. Like what foods do you love the most? What songs bring you joy? Um, what are the five places you love the most? What smells send you back in time? List difficult lessons you're glad you learned. Um, the hardest decisions you've ever made. Mm, list of values that matter to you. What small things do you do to make a positive difference in the world? Technology you wouldn't want to live without. I just think these questions and all are so interesting. And things that maybe you wouldn't find in other um, books. This section's about birth and babyhood. What adjectives describe pregnancy? Wow. <laughs> Where were you born? Who was there? What foods did your mother crave while you were in the womb? How big were you at birth? I mean, it goes back. What is your first memory? You know, this is so great. And then it goes to childhood. Same thing. It, it talks to you about it. It gives you prompts. What's your childhood neighborhood like? What does Christmas smell like? Thanksgiving, Easter, your birthday. What aromas let you know it's time to celebrate? What was your best childhood birthday and what made it special? Who was there? What did your mother's voice sound like? What did your grandfather's voice sound like? What's the craziest thing you did as a child? What clothes do you remember as a child? I mean, wow. These just uh, bringing back some memories, seriously. So I like 
I'm serious. I just jumped right into this book. I did like 12 pages and I just started, just got this book from the um, publishers. And then your school years, goes through all the schools, elementary, high school, middle school, that takes up a good amount. If you could relive a single day in high school, what would it be? Oh my God, none, maybe graduating. And then it goes into adulthood, young adult, Craziest roommate story. Oh, I've got one of those. What's the best thing about aging? What makes you feel young? Who do you love the most? Wow. Now that you're older, what aspects of childhood are you nostalgic for? Wow, these are so cool. What holiday traditions did you keep from your childhood? love this is going to be an awesome section in september of this year 2018 my husband and i will be celebrating 25 years and we're still like little kids so yeah um work you get the idea it, it is just amazing book i'm so excited to fill this in and i think that I think that one day my daughter will pick this up and really, really get to know who I am because there's things, you know, there's things that you just don't tell your children or, you know, all your secret pasts and goals and this and that. Some things you just don't talk about, but I really like how this, it's like a, my little personal diary that I didn't have to think about it. It's just there. You just answer all the questions, honestly. So I think you people would like this book. Bucket of Awesome. The spine looks like your life story is awesome. It says even if you can't write, you can follow prompts. So check this book out. I will post a link to where you can purchase it. If you have any questions about the book, please let me know. And if you haven't hit that sub button, please do. And a thumbs up would be great. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye.